Hey guys, so I went over my dollar pickup. I'm gonna show you my Pokemon collection as well. It is not magic related, but again, this is my channel. So, and I wanted just to make it because I was able to pick up a lot of these at flea markets. So kind of like a flea market haul. And they were not expensive. Uh, definitely they're not that common flea markets, but they're not expensive as well. So let me zoom out a little bit so you can actually see some of the cards better. I think that's probably good enough. So I'll point out some of the cards I love. So definitely Altaria is one of my favorite ones. Mew, can't really go wrong with Mew. You have your Blastoise EXs, your Mega Charizard, Mega Houndoom, and these are for trade and sale if you guys want to do that. Mega Ampharos, Magnetic, Ampharos here, Mewtwo EX, Kingdra, Enbor, Reggie, Rock, Absol, love this Absol and Mega Mewtwo, which is pretty cool. Mega Alkazam, and Darkrai, Keldon, don't even know who that dude is. Um, Seismic Toad, two Pidgeots, a Mega Alteria, uh, and free Charizard, six Charizard EXs. And the Glaceon, Sylveon, Sylveons, uh, this card is pretty cool, it is foil, Flareons, Vaporeon, some cool trainers, a play set of Evo Seuss Soda. And then you get into the more beautiful artwork, in my opinion. Uh, two Alteria Full Art EX, uh, four Charizard, a Venusaur, Blastoise, Ampharos EX, Dragonite, Ho Oh, these are full arts. So these are the hardest ones to come by, and they're the ones I love the most because they look gorgeous. Not all of them are super expensive. And another page of full arts, including Mega Mewtwo, Rocket, uh, two Mega Mewtwo EXs, definitely hard to come by. Alexam, Espeons, Scissor, and Dark Ray. So that's about it. I do have some, you know, other, I'm collecting these. They're not incredibly valuable. So all in all, I think that whole collection cost me less than uh, probably less than $300 to pick up all of these. And the most, I know like 150 of it was to pick up this, these six right here. So then the other fixed, so like these are not expensive. So Glaceon, I think is only like five, four, five dollars. Sylveon Full Art is like $2. So this whole entire game is relatively inexpensive to pick up unless you're going for something like, you know, these. Uh, these, I think charge arts were 25 a piece, and then I feel like the Venusaur and Blaster was also around that price. Um, but yeah, otherwise, it, this is the collection I got from picking up mostly at flea markets. Uh, definitely, you can find poke When you go to a flea market, it's nice because I collect anime, Pokemon, uh, comic books, all types of stuff. So it's very easy for me to pick something that uh, is good, uh, mainly because I can buy various stuff like video games as well. Anyway, bye guys.